How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here. We are continuing our stray playthrough. This is episode 5 and we are in Midtown. Let's go ahead and jump back in. I'm excited to play. This could be the final episode, but I don't know really how long the game is, so I guess we'll see. All right, here we go. So, uh, the last thing we did is uh, we got the atomic power cell and then we, we came to tell Clementine, but apparently Clementine was gone. And after discovering some clues, uh, we figured out that he left us a message to find him in the nightclub. So we do, oh boy, wow. That, okay, there's a drone right outside of this door. So I'm a little bit nervous. Let's let's wait until the drone goes by again. Oh my gosh. Oh my, whoa, what? Okay, is there a back way out of here? Cause that is very dangerous. All right, you know what? We might just have to uh, run by. Let's do it. Too slow. Didn't actually mean to do it this way, but it worked out. Um, if I can jump down anywhere. Apparently I can't jump down, so maybe this was a bad route. <laughs> Alright, let's find the stairs. I'm not sure where the stairs are. I think they're back here, so let's just run. Where? Oh boy. Okay, here's the stairs. We're good, we're good, we're good. Hello. Too slow. Bye bye. All right, back into Midtown. Uh, now, the thing with the nightclub was there's a bouncer and I'm not sure how to get into the nightclub. I think it was over here. So we're gonna have to find a different way into the nightclub, of course. It always works out like that. Now right, let's talk to the bouncer again. Not for you, go away. Uh, how about if I give you this battery? A bribe, I don't take bribes. What is that anyway? Well, let's talk to Ace. Ace, this it's the dudes. It's the dudes that we helped with the uh, security cameras earlier. I don't think the bouncer is going to let us in. Hey guys, I think we're gonna have to climb at the back again. Oh, okay. Let's climb up the back way then. So let's go behind. Is there a way up? It looks like there may be a way up right here. Oh, whoa! I never noticed this person up there. Howdy, partner. Why don't you come over here so I can get a good look at you? Hmm. He's inviting us up there. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can climb up and all the way to the back of the nightclub. I, I'm assuming this is a person who is trying to help us with that. Even though we've never met this person. I like his golden monitor helmet. Look at his hel His face is gold. Wonderful. Look at this little cutie. Oh, that's literally all you're gonna say? Wow. All right. Um, hmm. All right, let's see. How do we get around here? Let's go up and around. Um, can I go up even higher? No? Is this a dead? Oh, there's a door right here. Ha, <gasps> of course. It's locked, but let's scratch it anyway. See if something happens. I don't know what the downstairs neighbors are up to. I keep hearing buzzsaw and hammer noises. Do <laughs> you think that was a buzzsaw? All right. Um, I guess we can't do anything right here. Bummer. All right. We'll climb back down then. Cat. Walter. Maybe, maybe I got to go around this way. <gasps> hey, how'd you get up here? You want to party with us? Here, jump in and get a drink. Dude, what a homie. He's actually helping me get into the nightclub. Oh, guys. We made it to the nightclub. It's actually awesome in here. What? Dang. This is sick. All right. So where is Clementine? Let's look, have a look around, shall we? Knock off all these bar Dude, look at this guy's helmet. Oh, that is sick. Dragon dude. You like my mask? I made it myself. It jams the sentinel scans and it looks cool. 
Dang, dude, that's actually sick. Sup, sup, sup. What's this? A record! Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm holding this whole record! Alright, let's put the record on the... Uh, let's give the record to the DJ, right? Yo, DJ. I'm bringing in my new record. Why don't you drop this? Oh my gosh, I'm scratching it! Oh, that is awesome. I think we got an achievement for that too. Sick. Oh, elevator. All right. Oh no, we squished him. Can I use this to get up top or something? I don't know. It looks like I might be able to walk on those. Oh, I did get up. Oh, sick. It actually went back up by itself. I wasn't expecting that. But I can't really do anything up here. Okay, uh, back down please. Oh my gosh, I fell onto the switch. All right, let's look around a little bit more. Talk to the DJ. Yo, DJ. Oh, he's gonna go fix that. All right. Um, oh, there's a lever missing here. All right, so we need to find a lever there. Oh, it's this person. It's the, it's the guitar person. Wait, weren't you in the slums? Oh no, different, different person. Same, same haircut. I paid extra to get tonight's dance moves from the bouncer. He's the one programming the holograms in his spare time. Cool, cool, cool. What's that? It's like a can of air. Compressed air. Hmm. Let's keep looking around. Still haven't explored or talked to everybody. Uh, let's look at the bar. Usually there's something around the bar, right? Yo, bartender. What's up, dude? Hey, customer. The access to the VIP balcony is closed. Some private biz is going on there. It has been reserved by some blazer guy. Hey, that's the guy I'm looking for. So I got to go to the VIP section. Ooh, cutscene, cutscene. Hey, there he is. He's got the golden chains and everything. Ah, oh, so he's up there. He's he's literally just up top there. There he is. Yo, blazer. All right, so, so we do have to go up. I'm assuming the hologram and we need that lever. We need the lever to, all right, so. Let's talk to people, see if we can find somebody that has the lever. Enjoying yourself? Yeah, you're not helpful. Hmm. Let's talk to everybody. If we talk to everybody, I'm sure we'll find somebody with a lever. Yo, dude, <laughs> look at him doing the, oh my God, that's so funny. Uh, hey, you, what's up? Give it to the left, give it to the right. Beep boop, sweep swoop. It's called the Zagima dance. All right, you're not helpful. Pff, this club sucks. When I tried to go to that stupid VIP room, they kicked me out. Yo, he's got the lever. So I stole this lever just for kicks. If you get me a drink, I'll give you this silly lever. I don't need it and I don't want to be caught with it. Well, then why did you take it, dummy? Uh, he needs a drink, so let's go find a uh, drink to give him. Maybe at the bar? How about this golden drink? Yep. Wow, too easy, dude. Too easy. All right, so we're going to get the lever, and then we'll go up and see what happens. We'll be able to talk to Blazer, hopefully. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're not a good person, but here's a drink for the lever. Thanks, bro. Oh, we're making good progress here. Wait, what? Oh. All right. Now let's jump on this side and see what happens. All right, DJ, come put it back up. No, I love his helmet. It's just like a giant ball. All right, how about on this side? Ah, yeah, here we go. Now we have some access. Um, all right, what's this? Ooh, we got buttons. All right, what happens? Oh. So this is like a puzzle. Let's just push all the buttons. Uh, let's push this one again. I don't think we can get across. There we go. Now we can. Yep. I bet you this is perfect. 
Guess we'll find out. All right, now do I gotta go to the other side, probably? Sorry, dude, sorry, DJ. Actually, come back to this side. <laughs> Let's do both sides at once. DJ, over here. He's like, stupid Kaz, stop doing this. You're ruining the holograms. Over here, bro. Thank you. Love you. There we go. Wait. That didn't... It actually didn't help me at all. Maybe I actually do have to go on the other side. How do I get... A okay, let's go back up on this side. This side, DJ. Maybe I have to do it from here. DJ! Dance, you fools, dance! They all stop and look at me when I, when I meow. That's crazy. All right, so maybe I gotta do it from here. Wow, I was stupid. I could have just jumped on it right here and I went all the way. Okay, wow, I'm stupid. It's okay. Wait, no, 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 no. Don't lower it. What's happening? Blazer left the VIP section. Okay. Yo, these lights are actually sick though. What's up, dude? I have a very good relationship with the Sentinels. I don't understand why people complain so much about them. Okay. Good for you, bro. Uh, wait. What? Who is that? It's Clementine. Oh. Hmm. 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 Oh, he can't talk. <laughs> the rope is covering your speaker box, or what? Blazer, the betrayal. Two birds with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. Bro, you helped me steal the battery to recharge the subway station. For what? Just so you could capture us both? <laughs> the sweat. Dude, why are you betraying us? Business is money. Oh, money. That's what you want. And I value money way more than friendship or camaraderie. They are all yours. Wow. Blazer. I knew. I knew I couldn't trust the dude with the gold chains. I'll get you back for this, Blazer. Oh no, I'm in Alcatraz. Get it, Alcatraz, Alcatraz. I'm locked in a cage hanging over the sewer. And I can look around slightly. We're gonna rock it, rock it, rock. There we go. Wow, too easy. You shouldn't have hung me from the ceiling. You should have just bolted me to the wall or something. <gasps> the outside. We're so close, dudes. I should just escape to the outside right here and my mission is over. This whole quest can end. Sorry, Clementine, but I'm just trying to get back to my family at the same time. You know what I mean? I guess we got to go up. Ooh, the red room. Really? You're going to put a light just for this little thing? Jail. Oh, man. This, is this the fight? Nah, this is probably the next to last chapter. There's probably one more chapter after this, right? Mm, I think we got to go over here. There we go. That didn't really help. I can't, where am I supposed to go? Get 
Dude, am I just blind? Oh, I can jump down to this thing. Now I can jump up or down. I kind of want to jump up. Oh, come on. The icon is right there and it won't do it. Maybe I got to like swing that one left and then really quickly. Actually, maybe it'll work now because I don't, I don't even know what I'm trying to get to. Like that didn't where what? Uh, maybe I just got to jump down on top of the cage and then, uh, and then onto the barrel. Yeah. Okay. All right. I make it way harder than it needed to be. You know, it happens sometimes. Sometimes it happens. Oh, look at they're torturing him. Dude, that's messed up. Wrapped in chains and electrocuted? Why are you doing that? Is that Clementine? I hope not. Clementine's gonna be messed up in the head before we can even rescue her. Also, I don't have my drone anymore. You notice that? That's not a good thing. Um, just gonna keep looking around and see where we go. Oh, we got a, we got a drone, security drone. Dude, I'm right in front of you, are you blind? Do I really have to run by this dude? Is that? Wow, the clouds are like glitching. Uh, do I really have to run by this dude or is there another way? I guess there's no other way, so we're gonna run. Okay, wish me luck. Too slow, bro, too slow. Way too slow. I don't know if this is the right way, but we're doing it. Oh, I made it into a cell. Oh, <laughs> dang. Too late for this go this one. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Go away. Go away, you stupid drone. Go away. <laughs> Every time I meow, he hears me. No, come back on this side. Bro, oh, really? Whoa! Stop! Stop! Dude, this guy is... This guy is smart. How do I get by that door? Let's try this way. Nothing? How do I get... Oh, I gotta jump up. I gotta get up somehow. Well, the drone is glitching a little bit. He's. Let's jump up right here. Never mind, never mind. Dude, I need to distract him over here. Come in here. And I think I can climb up on the other way. Yes. Now, I can get up. No, up, up, up you fool. Quick, quick. I can't jump up there? Oh, are you kidding me? There's stairs right here. Like I said, I make things way too hard. Uh... Wait, is this literally the way I came? No, it's not, right? But I do have to get up there. This'll work. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, we're good. We found him! Clementine! I knew I had to get up somehow. Yeah, where's my drone? Okay, well, there's the key. 
I can't understand him anymore because I don't have the drone to translate. That's right. Um, I can't just jump through that because it's glass. But I can walk through that. Uh... Too easy, dude. I can grab those keys. And uh, I don't see my drone anywhere. That would be nice, but... Maybe if we free Clementine, he'll help us get the drone back. Take the keys, bro. I'm busting you out of here, dude. Be careful. Anything in here? No. Okay. Lead on, bro. Lead on. I'm... I'm assuming you know how to get out of here. Yes, unlock the gate. Are we free or are we still in the jail? Dude, I, I am not even surprised that we got betrayed. I figured it was going to come eventually. Somebody was going to betray us. I'm glad it wasn't Clementine. Keep walking, dude. Keep walking. Oh, cutscene. Uh, what am I looking at? Whoa, it's it's my drone. He's being contained. I have to go back and save him. Come back here, bro. I'm not done. If you leave me now, I'm never going to save you again. We have to save the drone. B12 is my only friend here, and I never would have survived without him. Plus, that used to be a human, and he's locked in a drone. We have to save him. Come on. We're going to get B12, and then we're going to get you out. Isn't that funny how they put B12 in, like, a maximum security laser prison? But they put Clementine in, like, some junky old cell not even really considering clementine a threat at all the drone definitely is more of a threat i don't know why the drone is so much smarter than the average robot i guess because he used to be human the the robots don't seem to be as smart as humans in this game which you would think you know hundreds of years of just being a computer and just being a computer in general you'd think they'd have access to like all knowledge that has ever existed ever what, you want me to go over here? Okay. What's the note on the phone? I, I want to read it. Oh. All right, well, keep going, keep going. Vending machine, and it's empty. Ooh. Obstacle course. I got to get over the laser? Not a problem for a little cat like me. Oh boy, almost fell. I, I might be a cat, but I do have a habit of falling every now and then. Uh, oh, I just gotta jump back when it goes by, okay. You don't see me. If I get in this box, it's not going to do anything, will it? Not really. Uh, do I have to jump that? Oh, I do. Right here. No, no, no. Go back up. Oh, shoot. That was close. I almost got zapped. Been a fried kitty. Oh, shoot. Did not see you, dude. Wait, he doesn't see me here? <laughs> Stupid drone. <laughs> and I can see through the door even more OP. 
Let's just go in here for a second until the drone comes back. This will allow us to look around. So I, I'm guessing we got to go in that room over there. So let's go check it out. Ah, oh, power switch. There we go. B12. He's, uh, uh, all the drones are like, wait. How do I, how am I going to distract all of those drones and rescue B12? We're not going to think about it. We're just going to do it. We're just going to do it. Ha! You stupidly fool. Wow, even more OP. I can go underneath. Alright, I'm gonna make a, a beeline for that door as soon as I can. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> something wrong, guys? Did you see something? Couldn't have been. Dude, this drone's just sitting there doing circles. Are you kidding me? Stop. Stop looking over here. Oh, I don't care anymore. Bye-bye. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we're out of here. We're out of here. Nice try. Nice try. Too slow. How do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Yeah, that's what I thought. You're too slow. Your aim is terrible. Um, Where am I now? <laughs> Easy. Oh, now he wakes up. Couldn't have wake up before, huh? Where's my backpack, though? Ah, uh, we're reunited. Oh, okay. He can just materialize it. I felt like I was trapped in my lab's computer system again, all alone. But you came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. What do you mean you can't believe it? We're partners. You would have came back for me. Right? I'm so glad we're all together again, but we're not safe. We need to find a way out of here. Can you open that door? Obviously. I got super computer unlike some people around here. My computer even has a flashlight. Just saying. Come on. You gonna open that or do I have to? Bro, do I have to do everything? Uh, where, how do I open? Bro, open the door. Just open it. Why are you looking? It's, it's like right there. Okay, I see the switch. I see the switch. I don't see a way to the switch. Okay, we got to go up there. Bro. Okay, I'm a little bit lost right now. And he won't even talk to me, which is... But I got B12, so let's talk to B12. The door's locked, but maybe we can find another way. Bro, you're not helping. Oh, bricks. Look. I'm going to break the window. Use a brick. Break the window so I can go in there, please. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Break the window. Do it. You know you want to do it. No, not the one up there. Just do what. Do the one right there. Really? That's the window you broke? That. That one. How am I supposed to get there? Oh, there's a ladder here, but I can't climb it. You're not very helpful, dude. You broke the wrong one. Are you going to boost me up? Boost me up. Yeah, okay. Now you're making sense. Okay. If you didn't do the boost, I would have been totally not able to get that. All right. Such a good team, aren't we? Another door instantly. 
Oh, this one will just open, right? Those sentinels are blocking the way again. They will spot me instantly. Maybe you can try to bait them into those cells and lock them in. Ooh, that sounds fun. I would love to lock some peacekeepers into some cells. You know what I mean? So I got to run in there and then lock them in. What's this dude doing? Do you see that guy on the ground over there? He was rebooted. I don't want to lose my memory. I'm so scared. What guy on the ground? Oh, way over here. This recovery center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear and lucid. I'm an exemplary citizen now. All right, so it does work. I'm just gonna have to uh, get some attention. Over here, dummy. Hey, dummy. <laughs> Easy. Come on, come on, come on. I'm sure the sentinel can open the door again, like, easily, right? Good, good, good. Oh, memory, memory. Hold on, memory. I was wondering if we would see memory soon. This poor fellow seems sentinels are ruthless when it comes to defying them. That's what I feared. They've completely erased him. No more emotions, no more self-awareness, no more memories. Please, let's not get caught. That was the final? Oh, dudes, we may be in the very end chapter here or something. Oh, we're not going to get caught. But if I do, I'm going to lock him in. Let's go. Let's go. What's the matter, bros? Too easy. Well done locking up that sentinel. We got to take the power back. Absolutely. So why don't you uh, help instead of just standing there? Ah, ah ha, ha. What? What? You did. Ah, ha, ha. That was funny. Oh, wow. He's He's crazy now. All right, where are we going now? Let's go, Clementine. Open. Open. Stay alert. We aren't in the clear yet. Uh, okay. While you're working on that door, I'll uh, just go around and uh, do this. <laughs> He's waving like, don't forget me, don't forget me. <laughs> Uh, this door is the only way out of the jail. I think we can open it from the control room. We have to find a way to access the room. Let's look around. Always like a tricky way, you know? Can you just punch through the glass and then I could jump in there? Like, just make this easy on everyone? All right, so that's how you get in the control room. And how do we get on the other side of this fence? Hmm. Oh, this truck can move, I bet. Yep. Or whatever this thing is. Come drive it. Back it up, bro. I need... I, we're in luck. They left the keys in the door. Hop on the back of the truck. You should be able to jump the fence. Yep. I knew it. Oh, <laughs> sick. I know. I'm getting up there, dude. Chill. Can't do it on the cutscene. Don't run me over, please. That would be bad. That's good, that's good, that's good. Alright, kill the engine, bro. You're bringing too much noise. You're gonna, you're gonna alert the enemy. Alright. 
Oh, I gotta go fast. I gotta go fast. Ooh, I like this music. Oh, hi. Oh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Not like this. I can't. I can't. What? I couldn't move. Are you kidding me? It wouldn't jump and it wouldn't move? Well, I was literally holding down A2 on that. Look, I'll do it again. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Yes, they're distracted by him. You stupid drones. Let me get on, let me get on. Floor it, bro, floor it. We're busting out of here. Oh, bro. Chill with that. Oh, thank you. Did you just lock me? There's no way we'll all make it with the sentinels on our tail. I can distract them for a little while, but you have to go. No, Clementine is sacrificing himself. The Outsider Manifesto says we must go outside at any cost. I wrote that. Dude, you could just come with me, though. You're one of us now. It's not that everyone has to get to the outside, but one of us has to. Dude, you could easily just come with. Go now. I'll keep you in my ram, little Outsider. Oh, my gosh. That... You should say your hard drive, because RAM actually is erased every time you reboot. Okay, whatever. Bummer. Clementine's just going to get caught again. Wow, that's sad, dude. That's so sad. Well, we can, act, we can turn on the subway now. Uh, turn on the subway. How do we do it? Right here? <sighs> I feel bad, dude. Clementine just totally sacrificed herself. Where's the, uh, the power breaker for this thing? Let's ask B12. I hope Clementine's alright. Let's fix the subway and get out of here. Yeah. How? Oh, is it underneath the rail car? Oh, I can't go underneath. Okay. It's got to be in here. If it's not in the front, then it's in the back, huh? All right. I guess we're going down. Maybe the controls are down here. They never actually told me, like, yep, here it is. Neko Corporation. Oh, baby. Subway is online for the first time in centuries. We have power. Wow, they just leave the cable laying right in the middle of the place. That's okay. Get me on board. We're out of here. We're escaping. I feel bad that we couldn't help everyone escape, but now that we have the subway turned on, can't we go back down to the lower levels? We can go back down to the slums, I think. Then we can rescue everyone. But first, let's rescue ourselves and go meet our family again, right? Control room. 
I can't jump on anything. And now we're in Tokyo. Ooh, vending machine. Dude's acting like he sees the subway every day. Bro, this subway hasn't come up here in hundreds of years. Have you ever not realized that? Hello, I may I help you. Okay, are we out? Oh my gosh, it's so nice and clean. Walled City 99. We made it to the top and yet there's still no humans. Greetings, inhabitant of Walled City 99. I am currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. Very creepy, guys. I have a feeling the robots are still working and there's no humans. Enjoy the world's safest city. Greetings, inhabitant. Walled City 99. This door is leading to the surface. is currently locked due to confinement procedure. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. So I gotta go to the control room and open the door to open it to the outside. We're still... Look, it's the ceiling. We can look down and see the slums. <gasps> uh, dude. Wow. Any soda? Guess not. Just try to check that. All right. Uh, is this the control box right here? Where's the control room? Oh, over here. And of course it's sealed. Open it. Open it, B12. It says only humans are authorized to enter. It also says that I'm not considered human. Hey, that's offensive. Maybe if we work together, we can open. Only a human can enter. Well, that's depressing. Hey, look at the the restrooms are here. Okay, well. Oh, here's one of these things. I remember this. Hey, what are you doing over here? No task. There you go. Um. I'm trying to press Y, it won't let me. Why not? Dude, why will I not press Y right there? Am I going crazy? I can't even turn this thing back on. Soda? Just had to check, just had to check. I see like a control panel right there. Man, the cement walls are kind of crazy. Ooh, okay, okay. Hack it, hack it, hack it. Scratch it! Screw your protocol, we're getting in. Oh, wait, I need, I need you again. Oh. Never mind, I guess not. We're in the control room, guys, where only humans have been allowed. They controlled everything from here, and it's empty. I remember hating them so much. They had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. Little good it did them. The plague! I remember now. Of course there was some. Everyone was dying. They thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. But I can still help you. We can still go outside together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. 
So there's literally no humans left. The final core memory, guys. The plague. Wiped out all humans. Maybe not all humans, but all humans in this area. They even left their coffee mugs. Like, just... Alright, well, let's open the doors. This is it, the main computer. Doesn't look very advanced. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. They never say how many years, just say how many. The whole city is stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. We'll need to bring the rest of these systems online. These computers hold the data we need. We need to turn them on. While you do that, I'll look for passwords and encrypted keys to get in the system. So you want me to turn on all these computers. Okay. On. 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 Man, these computers boot up fast. Keep connecting, B12. Keep connecting. I'm turning them on. Enjoy the world's safest city. It worked. Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Seems like it was too easy. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. There, that's the workstation to open the city, but there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. If we just open the roof, who knows what will cave into the city? Like, there could be an ocean above us. Like, we don't know. Now we need to do what we do best. I'll hack machines and you destroy some stuff. So if I destroy stuff, that will open the... He didn't say what to destroy. Oh. See, only a cat could do this, guys. A human would have never been able to. Okay, there's one control panel down. Uh, is there another one over here, or... Mm. Over here? Oh, here we go. Here's one for sure. Let's knock this over. That looked a little weird, but we're going to ignore that. All right, here we go. So if you just scratch all the security away, apparently uh, that's good enough, huh? Not much security, is it? Probably one more panel. Uh, where's the final panel? Oh, hack. Careful, buddy. The, 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 the system is taking more than I expected. Really? Oh no, we've got to keep going. Oh, I, I, I gotta hack this one. He's getting like attacked every time he hacks it. Uh, no, don't worry. I can recharge once we open up that workstation. B12 is going to die. Dude, if B12 dies, I'm going to be so upset. He better not die in this game. Okay, I still don't know where the final, like, workstation is, though. It's got to be right here. Oh, here it is, here it is. There we go. 
All right, all three layers of security down. And now B12 is down. I th th think my little body is done for. It's okay, I'll be all right. Just carry me to the workstation. We can disable the alarm. Whoa, look at, I'm like, Never mind, never mind, we're good. All right, recharge, recharge. We've gotten through all the security. That's it, we're safe. Listen, I have something to tell you. Oh boy, what's he about to say? I knew the power required to disable the city's central control system would be immense, more than this drone body could handle. I knew it! No, B12, don't do this. With the security disabled, I can take control of the system and open the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. But I made that choice when I hooked into that first computer and the consequences it could bring. I'm sorry we won't see the outside together. No. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see a future in the companions and you. Here, let me take that off you. No, B12. You were my friend, the very best I could have asked for. Thank you. He's literally erasing the last of humanity's memories by opening the city. No. Oh boy. Open the gates. Zerk is about to get zapped. They're gonna have to go somewhere else. Sunlight. It's Momo. He knows that I succeeded. Let there be light. Wow, even the drones died? That doesn't really make much sense. Wow. It was a giant dome or what? <sighs> B12, I'll never forget you, man. Okay, now I'm not gonna lay with you again. Wow. Wait, all right, so it's open, like, but how do I get out of here though? This place was just a giant hole. Literally just a giant hole in the ground. The people down there were the slums. The people up there, that's Midtown. They were like middle class. And then the people up in the suite were like the elites. But literally everybody died except the lowest and the middle, I guess they survived too. All right, door is completely open. But like, how are they going to get out? Like, it's still a massive wall. We need an elevator. Open the door.
Guys and girls, we did it. We made it out of Dead City. And now, the only thing left to do is to reunite with my family. I wanted to bring B12 with me. I don't like the idea of leaving his body back there. Maybe we'll come back for him. After all that, after facing an alien race, after working with many robots, I completely escaped. And not only did I escape, I freed an entire city of trapped, oppressed people. Because those robots were basically people. They had emotion, they had memory, they had consciousness, like they, they were people in robot bodies. And that is the end of the game, guys. We're gonna watch the credits because I want to see reunite with my family. Like I wanna see the reunion. And if they don't show it, I'm going to be very disappointed because at the very beginning of the game, those three cats looking down on me as I fell into the hole. I just want to get back to them. Amazing game. Uh, my overall rating would probably be 8 out of 10 if I had to rate it because it's a really unique and fun game. It's uh, It's got a not the most creative puzzles. Uh, a lot of it is get three things and then you can go here, get a couple things and you can go here. But it it's a good story. Very, very unique, interesting story. The fact you're playing as a cat, <laughs> I mean, that is unique. The music was very, very good. Um, you know, it didn't do too much with the combat, but it did just enough. And then as soon as you get the defluxer, you lose it. But it was still cool having it for a little bit. And um, wow, the characters you meet along the way, like Momo, Zabaltzar, Seamus, Clemency or Clementine, the Blazer dude. Man, what a game, what a game. I didn't know if we would actually finish it this episode, but we did. And we're at just about one hour. I'm gonna go ahead and wait and see if there's anything at the end of the credits. I don't know if there will be, but... Even though the game didn't take like super long to beat, maybe like six hours, uh, you know, I didn't get every memory. So I think we're actually gonna have to go, look at all the cats they used, wow. I think we're gonna, gonna have to go back and uh, find the rest of the memories. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do one more video of Stray where all I do is go get all the rest of the memories. Let me know. Um, I'm not against it. Thank you for anyone who has made it this far in the series. You basically watched the whole series. It actually means a lot to me that you support my channel, not just by watching Brahalla videos, but other videos that I make as well. I really, really appreciate it. And I wanna try doing more games in the future, obviously. Um, I'm not sure what I'll do next, but we'll see. All right, here's the end of the credits. Cut scene, cut scene, cut scene, cut scene, cut scene. No, there's no cut scene showing the reunion. Oh my gosh. Uh, well. We did it in four hours and 34 minutes. Wow, that was actually way faster than I thought. But look, we can go to any chapter we want and it shows how many memories. So there's no chapter where I missed every memory. We only missed memories, one in the slums, 
One in the slums part two, one in dead end, one in sewers. We missed five memories in Midtown. Wow, so we did, wow. Sheesh, we need to, so basically we only missed seven memories, five of which are Midtown. So let me know if you want me to go back at those seven memories. Anyways, that was Stray guys. Drop a like if you enjoyed and be sure to subscribe for more content. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, friends.